In this video, I'm going to show you how to create id.me account. So the first thing you want to do, you want to go to id.me and then here you want to go ahead in the top right and click on sign in. So as you can see over here, once you come to this website for the first time, sign in is going to be the button. You want to click on that and then here is going to say sign in to id.me. Now in case you have an account already, enter in your email and password or just sign in with Facebook, Google, LinkedIn or Apple ID and you can also view more options over here. These are all the options to sign in or in case you don't have an account yet, which you're going to create one right now, we're going to click on create an id.me account and here you can either put in your email, password and then confirm your password or again you can use one of the services provided here on the list. So for easy access I'm just going to log in using a Google over here because I do think it's the fastest way. You want to select your Google account like this and then press continue but of course all of those will work equally as good. Okay. Here you'll have to put in your email and then you'll have to accept the terms of service and privacy policy. Then you want to click on continue and then once you do this, it's going to start loading a bit. There we go. And then you will have to secure your account. So you'll have to do one of these over here. So these are essentially uh, one of the, uh, the the only ones. And then you're going to see your uh, security strength. So over here, it's going to be either fair, moderate, it's going to be strong or very strong. So you'll just have to select one of these. So for example, I'm going to click on pass key over here. And then what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to register your device. So you'll be prompted to unlock your device for registration. And then you'll have to follow the instructions to complete setup and then it says here it's a five minute limit so you have to just click continue and then once you do this you'll have to just uh, register your device i'm going to just create a key over here there we go so this has now been created as you can see it says activated mfa and then you can see your method over here and then here if you want to set up another one you can do that or just click on no which i'm going to do right now and then after you're done with this, you're going to see this is going to say returning to my account. And there we go. You've successfully created your account. As you can see, I'm now in here. I'm signed in and I can just start using it however I want. So that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.